The game we've been waiting for. Let's play it. Michigan will kick off. Washington will receive. Huskies in white. The visiting team. Napoleon Kaufman and Jay Barry are deep as J.D. Carlson kicks it off to the 12. It is Kaufman. It is Kaufman within a step of going all the way. The ball is at midfield. It is first down for the Washington Huskies in the white. Billy Joe Hobart is the quarterback. He turns. He fakes. He throws it down the pipe. It's thrown to Bino Bryant, and Bryant will have about four yards. 2,200 plus yards. That's a bunch. But he was picked off 10 times, meaning he's a big, strong guy who will sometimes force it. Mario Bailey had an All-American season for the Washington Huskies at wide out. And the big guys up front of the line is anchored by two 300-pounders. Kennedy at three and a quarter, Palomala at 305. On second down and six. This is Pino Bryant. He's a youngster from the Los Angeles area. Defensively, the Michigan Wolverines line up with the Butkus Award winner Eric Anderson at the linebacking position. This means something because no Michigan man has won an individual award since 1940. Desmond Howard, of course, was the other man winning individual honors this year. The secondary, the leader back there, is Lance Dutton, lanky fellow who is a tough football player. On third down in the yard, they give it to Bryant. Bryant is hammered. Short. Great uh, chance to do it. Up, they bounce it back to Riddell. He gets it off, and it's a very high, long kick, soaring out of bounds in the end zone. 24 touchdowns and only five interceptions. That'll warm the cockles of any coach's heart. Desmond Howard, of course, was the Heisman Trophy winner, the Maxwell winner. He set all kinds of records. And Ricky Powers is the man you'll see carrying that ball probably a lot today. But let's see what happens for Michigan on their first offensive play of the ball game. Van Dyne goes in motion. Gerbach gives the ball to Powers. And he rips his way out to the 27. The offensive front for Michigan is led by Skripanak. But a key man here, Bob Greasy, is Matt Elliott. He has to move over to the center position because Steve Everett has hurt a leg. On second down and three, the Wolverines get the first down. For Washington, that tackle was made by Jaime Fields. He's one of a core of linebackers that can really run. The big wrecker inside is Steve Empman, number 90. He spent um, uh, about eight hours in a hospital the past week trying to get rid of a virus. Gerbach is sacked back inside the 25. Why Steve Empman is considered the premier defensive football player out of the trenches this season. Gerbach gives to Powers. Into the stack he goes. Nothing doing. Howard is yet to be involved except for the kick return. It is third down and 17, and Gerbach is sacked for the second time. Number 48, Donald Jones. The passer. If they can't protect the passer, uh, it's going to be a long afternoon. This will give Washington good field position again as Bryant feels the punt, brings it back to the Michigan side of the field. Fifth spot of the picture, no back offense. Whip it out there to beat O'Brien. Bryant down the sidelines, gets it to the 42. Billy Joe Hobart with second down and six now. Puts Jay Barry behind him in the backfield, gives the ball to him on a little delay. And Barry, undefeated team in his coaching career. They are 11-0, and here goes Barry again. They line up with the eye. Hobart back, looks down the pipe, goes down the middle and throws a bad pass. It is intercepted by Otis Williams. And the Wolverines have something going on a fine return off the interception. In the nation in scoring in Washington, they are the best defense overall in the country. They'll come after you. Ball is given to Ricky Power, running to the left side. And second down and eight. Matt Elliott during the snapping. They go to the shotgun. Good snap, little delay, hand off to Powers, and Powers is hit by Hoffman. Third down, seven. Pressure coming, Mason right there, passes away, incomplete. Rose Bowl came. Eddie shanked it. And Billy Joe Hobart turns, gives to Bino Bryant, 
And Bryant tried to plant and cut. He has a remarkable record going at 19 and 4. Back goes Hobart on second down and 10. Throws the Hummer. And it is in and out of the hands of his tight end, Aaron Pierce. It's the inconsistency of the quarterback in big games. Pressure coming. Pass away. Orlando McKay. And it is slapped away. Good punt by Wardell. Runs Howard back to the 22. Gets a little help around the corner and brings it out to the 37. Tyrone Wheatley is in the backfield now for the Michigan Wolverines. Maybe the fastest of the Swift. And here's Gerbank. Let me go for Desmond Howard. It is intercepted on the ricochet by Walter Bailey. And so the first big try involving Desmond goes to Washington. This is Ben O'Brien carrying the ball, a junior out of Los Angeles. Washington with S on his chest is number five, Mario Bailey. He's yet to see the ball. Ben O'Brien, who has great speed. A nice game. Hobart back. Screen set up for Bryant. And a good defensive play. No score, first quarter, Hobart back. Gets his pass off. Whoa. Drive time live tomorrow night on ABC. Dino Bryant. No pressure and not quite as long as the other. And this time Desmond says, I've got a good field position. Don't want to mess it up. Bear catch it at the 32-yard line. Michigan offense in the Big Ten. They also are the fewest sack team in the... Uh, the Big Ten. We have an illegal procedure, offense, illegal snap, five-yard penalty. This guy's jumping. This is Wheatley. He's got company. Second down and 17. Burback on the floor. Going to go deep with it, throwing it for Howard, and it is incomplete. It is third down and 17. They're out of the shotgun. Gerbach's pass over the head. They're revving up. And not much pressure. That's a very, very high kick. And a fair catch called by Vino Bryant. They continue to dominate. Obert will throw it on first down. Underneath it goes to Aaron Pierce, the tight end. Huskies in the back 10, awfully good also. Penalty flags. We have an illegal procedure, illegal movement, offensive line, five-yard penalty. Second down and seven now for the Huskies. Obert wanted to go deep, goes underneath with it, gets his first down on the completion to Aaron Pierce. Sievers. loses the ball second down and 10 from the 40 over it right in between Gaspard and McKay 50 seconds to go in the first quarter no score over turns makes it lets it go deep Bailey got it six yard line first and goal Huskies Bryant to the five. His falling forward was good for a yard as we come to the end of the quarter. Bino Bryant surges by third down and goal for the Huskies as we come back for the second quarter. It is now third down and goal. They're calling at the two-yard line. Turner is in the backfield with Bryant. Is his Hobart keeping it and touchdown for Billy Joe. on Buster Stanley. Here's Travis Hansen for the extra point try, and it just can't, holy cow, it just got over. How did he get that thing over there? Oh, me, uh, it'll count. That's Nobody ever said how, just did it.
Desmond Howard, 21, Tyrone Wheatley, number six back. Jason Kraft will kick it off for the Huskies. And he shanked that one. I mean, he popped it straight up. Huskies rolling around with the ball on the sidelines. They may have it. Well, you have to give the other team a chance to catch. He waved his hand for a fair Did catch. Did he wave his hand? We got interference Two yards. with opportunity to make a fair catch. 15 yard penalty. All Get right, it blows up in the Huskies. The Wolverines start on the Washington side of the field at the 44 yard line. Johnson is number 30. Gerbach back. That's it go. And Howard's over there. It is caught by Desmond Howard. Hey, he whipped Dana Hall on that play. Had, but he out jumps. We him. had a defensive place mask. Interior lineman, the penalty is declined. Johnson is number 30. Did they get set in the backfield? I'm not sure they weren't moving around. With Ricky Powers, the tailback. The single back for the Wolverines. They're showing a lot of new formations today. Made a lot of changes because of the Washington defense. Gerback pitches it to Howard. Pressure. Down he goes at the 10-yard line. You got Yale Van Dyne lining up at tailback. He's a wide receiver. Now they put him in motion. And they send him over to this side. Double there. Look at Howard the other way. Gerback with good protection into the end zone. Touchdown. Caught by Walter Smith. A chance to tie with John Dennis Carlson. Good. All right, Michigan, having tied it at seven, will kick it off. 13.09 to go in the first half. On a bounce, the ball goes to Jay Barry. And the young man from Colorado who suffered a brutal knee injury last spring. Fights his way back and he's in the lineup right now. And he turns and hands and it's carried by Barry beyond Santa Barbara area. Sets up the throw, a little quick pop to the sideline to Matt Jones. Jones out of Portland, Oregon, is taken down. Moves out of the backfield now. No backs. Brunel throws, fast caught by Pierce, the tight end. Big play. Aaron Pierce. So Brunel's got a little something going here. Gives it back to Barry. He spins in the middle. And that spin is worth three yards. Rest of the year. On second down, Brunel back. Setting up a screen again for Barry. He's got a block. And now it goes away as he's taken down. It's away for James. Just calm down. Let another quarterback see what he can do. Just drill for the first down, a penalty flag and her, called for a hold. The 10 yard penalty in the previous spot, automatic first down. Well, the Washington Huskies in white against the Michigan Wolverine. Back goes Brunel again. His pass, a touch pass, thrown to number 22. He laid his steely blues on me about a month ago and said, Next spring, I'm going to get my job back. Yeah, it's going to be wide open. This is Barry. Got a penalty flag back at the 11-yard line. It's thrown to the umpire. And most of the time, that holding. I was wondering why. <laughs> Brunel sets up the screen for Bino Bryant. And the Wolverines run it down pretty well. Now for the Huskies on third down and eight. Without the penalty, they're leading. Comes one to the sideline to Orlando McKay, and he makes the catch down near the five-yard line. Holding, defense, goes the other way. Jay Barry, and Darius Turner in the backfield. This is Barry, cuts it back. Down he goes. Boy, that's a pretty good lick by Eric Anderson. Second down and goal from the five. Bryant goes in motion. Brunel keeps it. Look out, look out. Man has a bad, bad knee, and he's out there running around with the ball. So they're back on the seventh. Brunel looking around, pressure, gets it off into the end zone, and it is thrown away. And Coach Bo just jumped out of his chair. I mean, uh, that Fisher was looking in the wrong direction if he's finding those guys out on the field or near it. Travis Hansen puts it up good. 
And Washington goes back to the lead at 6.52 to play in the first half by a margin of three. Travis Hansen early in the season, and I, know, I think that's why they don't particularly want him kicking off. But this time, Crab hammers that thing back to the three-yard line for Howard. Down he goes. They are gathered into a tight little group, aren't they? <laughs> I'd say they were. <laughs> Wheatley, nothing doing, sir. Six-man front right down, down on the defense. Give it to Wheatley, pops it through there. Third down and seven. They set up the screen and as Kona doesn't get much on it. When he dropped that ball, the back of the ball, point of the ball, back point hit him on the ankle. Billy Joe Hobart is back at quarterback for Washington. They start at the Michigan 46-yard line, and B.J. rolls it out. Throws it complete to Darius Trump, incomplete to Darius Turner. To make some yards. Washington 10, Michigan 7, closing out the last few minutes of the first half. That pass is good to Mario Bailey. He's hit hard by the hit. This is Ben O'Brien. Nothing doing with that one. Bailey beat him in receptions and yards. And there's only two touchdown passes behind him. Michigan is in the neutral zone. The pass is thrown out of bounds. Yep. Second down and three. Run for it. Bryant, big hole. Still going. Ten-yard line. First and goal, Husky. Five 100-yard games this year. Goes again. There's the lick. Got him out in the flanker spot yeah. right now. Hobart looks looks at him, throws and hits him. Oh my goodness! What are you going to do? Bailey in the corner. No good. Good defense. Hanson has a 24-yarder today. This is 23 yards out of Eric Bjornsson's hole. Bailey snapping. He's had two bad snaps. This one's on the money. And so is the kick. At 3.29 to go in the first half. It's now 13-7 to Washington. And this is King lead out. And uh, I think he's tranquilized. <laughs> Yard deep in the end zone for Desmond Howard. He gets away from one man and then finally comes on back up. So Howard had him out to the 20. But now the penalty takes him back. Nobody has run on this team. Give it to Johnson and he found a little daylight. Debo tight end shifting over. Johnson. Johnson gives it off. Here it goes back to Howard. Howard's got it. He's got a wall on that side. He's got a first down. Ball is on the 34-yard line. Gerbach's pass on the throne. Intended for Yale Van Dyne. First, I mean, uh, Florida a and great I mean, Texas a and Oh, my goodness. And we're all happy for him and his family. Gerbach now on third down and 10. Gets his pass away, and it is poorly thrown and dropped by Jesse Johnson. Uh, Eddie Asgoda. Uh, that's a little better. Bryant all the way back to the 14. Oh, look at that. Oh, coming from the backside. He's tracked the 213 to play in the first half. Have all three of their timeouts remaining, and they start from the 26. Over to the quarterback. On first down, the pass to Aaron Pierce, the tight end. Underneath again, that'll be good for the first down as uh, Beto Bryant. Minute and 59 to go in the first half. 13 to 7, Washington lead. Over loses its footing and slides down. The day goes on, and as you get down toward dark, Michigan blitzing, and Hobart now pumps it up, lets it go. Intercepted! Pierce didn't put the ball away. It just bounced off his chest right into the hands of Steve Morrison. But the Wolverines trying to cash in an opportunity here from the Washington 29. Gerbach sacked back at the 41. Steve Eppman. From the 41, Elvis back. Going to get it again. 
Number 13, Andy Mason, chases him into Epman. The Huskies' first touchdown in last year's game. Ball is given to Tyrone Wheatley. He isn't going anywhere either. Point, 20 odd seconds to go. Why not try something if you got something up your sleeve? And the uh, Huskies don't want anything to do with this because they're going to let that thing roll dead down on the three yard line and let at halftime. Well, he didn't exactly put his knee down, did he? But the half is over. So, six point lead at 13 to 7 for Washington over Michigan, and we'll be back with the halftime activities after this message and the word from our ABC station. Who did take him down was six out of uh, seven for 51 yards and a field goal. Desmond Howard has the ball to start the second half of play, and the Huskies have Desmond at the 23 yard line. So is Powers to start the second half. Double wide to the top of the picture. And Gerback gives the ball away to Ricky Powers, and he'll pick up with one tackle. Oh, uh, yeah, more than that. Well, they, had seven, they had seven tackles for losses behind yeah. him. Powers is run down. It is third and nine now. Gerbach back to throw the ball. Jones just missed him, throws it over the line. It is caught, but Hoffman feet are similar to, to what Washington did. Kick is away, low line drive. It's taken by Bryant. Got a little daylight, needs a block on the corner. Got it. And crosses midfield. Nine. Ooh, look at that over the bench. Oh. Over. Passes away. Bailey is out there heading to. Bailey was wide open. Well, McCain. Very high. Out of bounds. Oh, it didn't. It kicked back inbound. Well, that's a very artistic piece of kicking. Wheatley is in the backfield, and a little swing pass out to Wheatley. He can fly. Hoffman is out there, 54. He missed him. But he's iffy. He'll be in, and he'll be out. Pitch back to Wheatley again. Finds a hole. Plays in a row, 19 yards each play for Michigan. Now they've got six of them down. They go after him this time, and they hit him behind the line of scrimmage. Howard is down to the bottom of the picture, going in motion the other way now. They put him out there against Tommy Smith. There's tremendous speed. There it's still about 10. Go back pass. Over the head. We have a defensive team, violation neutral zone, five-yard penalty. Let me put it this way, I'll be very surprised. Well, those, those plays... Yeah, they just gave him the yeah, five those, yards back. Those plays are good if they work. Another penalty flag. Eno Bryant chases down the kick, takes a sideways bounce, and goes out of bounds up on the 25-yard line. The defensive team, offside. <laughs> kick thing. Get it out of there. Andy Mason had some penetration. That's a very good kick. Vino Bryant calling fair catch, and the ball dribbles on into the end zone. His prolific beard, he gets a little whiter. We're going to get you a red suit. Here go the Huskies to the attack now with Vino Bryant. Now they put two wideouts at the bottom of the picture, hand it off inside to Bryant, and for the conferences at halftime. Over, makes it, keeps it, throws it, plays good to Pierce, the tight end. First down, Washington, just short of midfield. Call it the 49 yard line. Over, a little quick drop, a little quick pop to the sideline, pass caught by Gaspard. Curtis Gaspard out of New Orleans, Louisiana. Huskies lose all, all three of their top receivers next year. Vino Bryant is in no man's land back there. Over. Again, throws 
short goes to the fullback Turner and Turner is down to about the 30 receiver by the time he gets the ball third and four there goes Bryant that's the first down at the Michigan 25 run it again and music from the U.M. band over wants to go deep almost has it intercepted he took a lick didn't he he did On third down, goes outside. He's got some room. Throws it. And he was all right. He was not across the line of scrimmage. The vape inside the five-yard line. Pitch it back to Bino Bryant. And he gets planted by Eric Anderson. Over. Stops. Throws back across. Touchdown. the touchdown the other tight end catches the two-point conversion it's 21 to 7 Washington an unsportsmanlike call moves the ball on a penalty on the kickoff up to the 50-yard line for exactly what it is not defined Jason Crabb will kick it off and Desmond Howard will wait for it down there with Wheatley but uh, he hangs it high at the one-yard line. It's Wheatley. Oh, look out. Almost got a face mask, and they get him way back down the field. Powers out of the end zone will get two on the play. There's too much skill there. That's one of the best offensive lines I've ever seen in college football. Look at this. The basic problem, Keith, that Washington has taken the running game away from them. They're back in the end zone. Gets his pass off to the sideline, and it's thrown into the band. Defensive back, but he's 4 15 and 67 yards. As Kona gets a pretty good kick out of the end zone, Vino Bryant takes it at the 43, looking for a little help, retreats and goes down at the 48. Vino Bryant is being helped to the bench. That's bad news for Washington. <laughs> End of the game is Jay Barry, number 42. Second down and five. This is Barry again, and nothing there this time. Right ankle injury for Bino Bryant. Billy Joe Hobart throws the ball quickly, gets it outside out there, and gets his first down to Mario Bailey. <laughs> <laughs> This is Matt Jones. Double tight end, Pearson Bruner. Barry. Over. Let's it go to the corner for Orlando McKay, and it's too long. Jack thinks. They got enough points. They need, they, defense is all they need now. No back. Fourth and one, and no backs. Over just pulls it down and dives ahead and picks up him, don't you? I like his size and I like his arm strength. Over back, comes one down the pipe. Pierce pulls it in. He's inside the 10 yard line. This is Barry. And he'll take it down to the five for a three yard pickup. Second down and goal. And we run out of time in the third quarter. Washington leading 21-7. Looking to get more. We'll be back after this message and the word from our ABC station. Second down and goal for the Huskies. Give it to Barry. He's at the three-yard line. I don't know how fast he is. I would think he'd make a very good linebacker. In the so do I. Pass. Touchdown. Pierce.
Kick is good. No, it's not good. He missed it. He missed it. 27 to 7. Deep and Michigan needs some big plays. Sweetly comes sidling up, lets it bounce in front of him, and then takes off down the field to the 29-yard line. The score is often in his passing. Michigan's longest sustained drive so far in this ball game today has been five. So it's second down and ten for Michigan, trailing 27 to seven. The domination of Washington defense has been total. Out of the shotgun, Gerbach moving around a little bit, gets his pass off. Not loose. That's a long one. Gerbach trying to go for it. I don't think he made it. I don't think he made it. On fourth and about a yard and a half. They have not squared off as such. He didn't make it. Husky hold and take over. But the Hurricanes uh, are looking at this one and knowing what their job is just to stay up with Washington. There's no replay. Two arms went up. That's all I can tell you. Yeah. Yeah. No, he didn't. I don't. Uh, I don't know about that. One. Yeah, that, that's get a little help from the ground on that one. Kick. It's good this time. And it's just like that. 34 to seven. That probably is the will breaker. Mario Bailey there in the middle who just caught the touchdown pass. The kickoff will drift back to the four-yard line for Tyrone Wheatley. Freshman out of Dearborn Heights, and he's out close to the 29-yard line. If, if, if Washington really wins by a big margin, Miami may have to do the same thing this evening. Gerback is 5 of 17 in the ball game, 72 yards. Ricky Powers is your tailback. We're back to throw it. Pressure coming from the backside. Gets it away. Pass is good. And we got a lot of depth at linebacker. Gerback throws it down the middle. That's a pretty good catch by Yale Van Dyne. They really give you some speed. Gerback's pass. Going out to the sideline again, Ricky Powers, the tailback. Run against uh, the Washington defense. Whoa. Their back gets it away just in time, and it ricochets off the arm. Offensive team. Third down. Wheatley. Uh -huh. He can hold it. It's a touchdown. Tyrone Wheatley showing you his blazing speed. And it's good. In the first 26 plays of this ball game, rushing Michigan at 35 yards. On that one play, they get 53. Onside kick coming up. Good bounce on it. Good bounce. Falls in the air. Washington got it. Touchdown. And both of them did that last year. So the Huskies go to work now with Napoleon Kaufman at tailback. And I won't tell you how much Michigan football. Is. That's Kaufman. And Michigan's been to 16 consecutive bowls. Yes. The Sugar Bowl, Notre Dame, and Florida. 
Billy Joe Hobart throws that ball down the middle for his tight end Aaron Pierce. He's had an insurance policy, a million dollar insurance policy to protect him. Pass intended for Orlando McKay. Headed to the corner. Desmond makes the reception at the pin. And then goes out of bounds. Well, nice to He's been back. He's been playing. Then he hurt his ankle out here this week and was not able to play in the game today. But he has another year left. This is Wheatley. Target. He was banging on the side of his helmet with one hand and pulling the toggles with the other. Gerback throws hard. Catch is made and Wheatley fighting. He trails Desmond now by one touchdown on the year. Howard's up there on the boundary with Dana Hall checking him, and Gerbach will get no chance to throw it. Dave Hoffman got him. Gerbach has not had a lot of time to look for him. Gerbach, after the sack, lets it go, and Wheatley. It's a bunch. Third down. Pressure coming. Jones after him. Passes away. Ricky Powers. We short of the first Wolverine baseball. Might be a future fullback. On fourth down, they go for it. And Gerbach gets it. He threw a hummer to Yale Van Dyne. And Van Dyne that has ever played college football. One of those tonight, though. Jesse Johnson on an inside handoff breaks the play big. And <laughs> first down. Oh, the ball squirts right out of Gerbach's arm, up into the air, and put down on the ground. That's high, too. Gerbach manages to catch it. Throws to Van Dyne. Van Dyne's become the principal receiver. Steve Everett is now in the ball game at center. Wanted to play some, and he's in there. There's Infinity Dead Tournament boy. of Champions. On Michigan now, eight penalties and 62 yards. They're back down again. Croatia, so they decided to go to the U.S. Two of their children born here, two born uh, in Croatia. And a pretty good kick. Billy Joe Hobart in there at quarterback with Barry behind him. Give it to Matt Jones, the up man out of the eye. A year ago when we got up in the morning with all kinds of possibilities. This is Barry carrying. Uh, that's a pretty good football team. Now. And that ball is almost picked off. You get all that commitment and they both lost. They both lose. Exactly. You have a mess. Or one of them loses and then you got the game plan. You've sold tickets for us. Coverage on Howard. No chance. Well, that's for sure. Everybody talking about it. Discussing it. Down goes Todd Collins, a red shirt freshman from Walpole, Mass. And Todd just got baptized. 13 total tackles for a loss by the Husky defense now. Collins pass almost intercepted. Or if they win by too much, uh, <laughs> it's not enough if you win. Now, if you win by too many, they would get on you. If you don't win by enough, they get on you. On third and 19, a pass to the sidelines. Uh, particularly out here in the Rose Bowl, I don't think we've ever played against one that's been quite that good. Sorts of uh, duress on the sideline. Another great job for Jack. As the hotter Todd Barry, computer stats, Mark Demetto and Tim Goodman. Eric Jornson checks in at fullback now. Give it to the Coley. Cuffman, and he slips as he tries to make his cut. Bjornsson sets him up. He's got Kaufman at tailback. Gives it to him. And he sort of disappears into the crowd. Don James himself uh, said it would be a shame if one of them. This is Kaufman again. And he's not going to get to the end zone. They roll him up inside the five. And time runs out. And Don James has his first ever undefeated season. The first ever 12-game winner at the University of Washington as the Huskies beat the Michigan Wolverines.